kind of uh, jump into what we call uh, a custom form, right? Where you can definitely add a bunch of different um, attributes. Uh, so you can begin um, kind of building your own farm exactly the way you want it. So it's actually really easy using our PCT Title Toolbox um, tool that we have here. So first and foremost, let's definitely go over to our farming and let's go ahead and let's do an area search today. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna look at a city overall. All right, so let's go ahead and let's, if I'm defaulted to Los Angeles, let's go ahead and let's look at down in California. Okay, so we're gonna look at County of Los Angeles, the city of Downey for SFRs and condos. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna hit get count. All right, so I want you to see how many actual records are available uh, within the city of Downey that meet these requirements and then how we can begin to kind of weed those down. So as you can see, we have 19,000 records. Now, obviously farming to 19,000 is a pretty big task. So why don't we go ahead and start to add some parameters so we can go ahead and begin to bring those numbers down, right? So in property characteristics, maybe we want um, anything that is equal to, uh, let's say four bedrooms and two baths, right? So now let's go ahead and see what happens when we basically add those two requirements, of four bedrooms and at least two baths. So now we went down from 19,000 all the way down to 1,500, which there's definitely a lot more affordable when it comes to uh, our marketing dollars, right? So now that we have kind of our property characteristics, um, we can do other information like a specific purchase price, sale date, um, whether they are delinquent on their taxes. We have other information as well, um, like a specific mail carrier route, uh, zoning um, for properties as well. We have this really cool feature where you have other available fields, right? So you can have number of structures on the property, um, whether it's, you know, an equestrian area for horses, um, whether they have a basement, whether they have two stories. So two stories is big, right? So why don't we go ahead and say, let's click on two stories. Okay. So number of two stories equals two. So let's go ahead and let's get a count there. So now again, right, we have single family residences and condos, four bedrooms, two baths that are two stories. Let's go ahead and hit get count. All right, let's see what actually comes up. So now we have 106. So now you can see we went from 19,000 down to 1,500, down to 106, right? 106 is a very, very doable number to send out a mailing campaign to do door knocking or do multiple mailing campaigns, right? Because again, right, the number is so little, we can definitely continue to um, drip and send a couple of mailers in hopes of sparking a phone call or a conversation. So that is how we can definitely, you know, begin to take a larger area and bring it down just slightly. So why don't we go ahead and let's add an additional filter to this, right? So just so we're looking at single family residences and condos in the city of Downey, four bedrooms, two baths, two story. And why don't we go ahead and go to our custom filters and look at maybe any of them that are absentee owners, right? People that are potentially renting in these areas. So let's see what actually comes up. Okay, 10, right? 10 is a very, very powerful and doable number, right? So as you can see, we went down from 19,000 down to 1,500, down to 106, now down to 10, right? We can definitely either call, door knock, mail. Um, we can get really, really creative when our target number is only 10. But again, right, this is the way you can build a custom farm by starting with a larger area and then adding little filters that can go ahead and begin to shrink your list and weed out anybody who might not be as fruitful for you in your farming efforts. That's as easy as it is. Thanks everyone.